In this video, we will walk through getting signed into your Rockwell Google account on a personal device such as a Mac or PC. On your device, open a web browser. It will work best in Chrome, however you can also use Firefox or Microsoft Edge if you prefer. In your web browser, navigate to the Google Dashboard using the gsuite.google.com backslash dashboard URL. Now your student will sign in with their Rockwell ISD Google account. Enter your student's Rockwell ISD username. Select Next. Now enter your student's password and click Next. The home page for all student accounts is set to the Google Dashboard. You can return to this page at any time by clicking the Home button. From the Google Dashboard, I will then select the program that I would wish to use. For Canvas, I select the Canvas icon. This will take me to my own Rockwell ISD Canvas dashboard. For Seesaw, I'll select Seesaw. If this is my first time doing this on this device, I'll need to select that I am a student. I'll click the Sign In with Google button. You do not need to enter a username and password here because the Sign In with Google button is referencing the Google Chrome account, account that you've signed into. Select the Sign In with Google button. authorize the Google account and now your account will be linked to Seesaw. You do not need to enter any student codes in Seesaw as these classes will be populated for you. Many programs that we use in Rockwell ISD allow for Google single sign-on as we just saw in Canvas and Seesaw. Once these accounts have been signed up, by clicking on these icons you will be able to sign in directly by simply clicking on an icon. No username or password will be needed for most programs. One of the best ways to avoid issues when using these single sign-on tools is to have separate profiles signed in to Google Chrome to switch between different users. Google tools will work best in Google Chrome, however you could also use Firefox or Edge if you prefer. This will not work in Internet Explorer as that browser is now out of date. Ideally, you want the student to be signed into their own Google Chrome window. To do this, select the icon at the top right and we're going to add a new person. I'll select Add Person, and this is going to be my student. I'll click Add. Now this is a separate window for this user, and we're going to make Chrome our own by get, and click Get Started. We'll skip this information for now, and we're going to continue. Now your student will sign in with their Rockwell ISD Google account. Into your student's Rockwell ISD username, select Next. Now enter your student's password and click Next. You will be asked if you want to link the data. You do want to link data. Say yes I'm in to turn on the sync. And now your student's Rockwell ISD Google account will be signed in here. To switch to a different profile, for another student or for yourself, select that icon again and you can toggle between the different accounts that you have available. The benefit to this is that each user is signed in on their own windows that way there's no conflict between which account is accessing these different Google tools.